Uh, hustle up, muffle up with the quiet chrome. I'm addicted to kick drums and xylophones. Bullets whisper in your ear in the quiet zone. Yo, I'm up in Philly. Chilling with my boy, yeah, Jack yeah. Frost. Yeah, yeah. What's happening, brother? I ain't all right, man. You know, I'm slow money, slow motion, slow money, better than no money. T shirts, internet grind, you know what I'm saying? Shows, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Uh, finally pulled my team together for a good project we got called The Beards in the Building. Uh, my team is the Beard Gang Click. It's me, uh, Reef the Lost Cause from Philly, Malik B from The Roots, formerly of The Roots from Philly, uh, Tanner the Beast. Uh, we got Tech from Smith & Wesson from up Brooklyn and uh, Freeway on some shit, you know what I mean? We just like, just, just working, man, like, you know what I mean? So when, when, when is... Is there like an actual official project coming out for Beards in the Building? Yeah, yeah. Um, the Beards in the Building project, we're trying to have all the records done by May 10th. That's the deadline that I set. And um, all, all the features and everything wrapped up. Because I'm at like 90% now with it. So I'm trying to have everything done by May 10th. So hopefully to have it up and out and on the internet by May the 25th. And it's going to be on iTunes and it's going to be for free on that Piff because it's all original beats. It's production by um, my man Detroit Red. He did a lot of G-Unit stuff back like in the early G-Unit days. Uh, my man Dirty Duns, Wiz Hizza, my man Hank McCoy from Philly. Um, I just did one joint on there. Uh, just like same group of dudes I've been working with on the beat tip, you know what I'm saying? We can put some new heat from Don Cannon. It might make it, it might not, but it's, it's a lot of good stuff, man. It's like this beard gang click, this this this, this beards in the building CD, what I what I um what I went for, I went for a mixture of NWA mixed with like a little bit of Wu Tang. And some boot camp, but on some Philly shit. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, we even give, you know, slipping a little bit of knowledge in there about Islam. Not forcing it on you, but just, you know, a lot of niggas rap about what they into, so that's a big part of my life. So you don't hear some of them bars in my raps. Like, it's not I'm trying to be a Muslim rapper. I'm a, I'm a rapper who's Muslim. And I live it every day, praying five times a day and doing stuff I'm supposed to do. So you gonna hear references in there the same way I used to hear the Wu references and referencing the um, you know the five percent thing, you know what I'm saying, like that. So it's like not to compare the two, but to compare the two, you know, like an example of like, you know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah, so like yeah, just like um the beats are so east coast. It's crazy. That's what I like to hear, man. Beats is like that boom bap. Like I was on the um, I was talking to Premier the other day, and, and me and Premier. Is that the nigga Jack Frost? And me, and, me and Premier like on yeah. some shit like we trying to like do some like um some like an EP like one EP just to show niggas that hip hop is still where it need to be. You know what I'm saying? So That's gonna Primo, be, yeah. Primo a busy nigga though. Yeah. So, but he been. We've been going back and forth. Oh, shout out to DJ Skins too, cause DJ Skins, um, he on, uh, he got an album called the BQE. He produced all the all the songs on there, and uh, it's crazy. Like from what I heard, it's crazy. Uh, Sean P is on there, MOP is on there, a lot of big name, Big Twin, uh, so many dudes, Rock Marciano, and you know what I'm saying. Eclipse, Eclipse is my. I met e I met Skins through Eclipse, through DJ Eclipse. And DJ Eclipse, I'm at Premier too, so it's like all like one, everything's just clicking, man. Like, I never thought for like Premier to hit me and tell me he ain't hear one record that he ain't like yet. So really, that's my fuel right now, that. And then when people like y'all hit me and be like, yo, I want to do this project with you. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, that, that mean a lot, because I pay for everything and do everything myself. So whenever I get any positive feedback or any people who want to reach out to me to do an interview or to do a project or to do a show, or even if it's just to ask me to come and speak to some kids or something for me, I feel like if y'all think that much of me, that I should be a part of what you're doing, then I feel like that my work is, is being recognized, even if it's not like one big, you know, like international superstar thing, it just make you feel good, like, you know, 
called me first thing in the day, like, yo. Then we just got back from Easter Blip, rocking me, PD Crack, Freeway, and all of us, burning that down. Then to be out here doing just consistent stuff, you know right, what I'm saying? Right. It's just a good thing, man. It's a good thing. Riot gear, riot pump, in the riot zone. Yeah, let's start it up. We gonna make this fucking riot known. The streets sweep the whole hood into.